Fast break basketball for the Magic. Isaac hammers it down. Vucevic again. Ooh. Put back up and in by Isaac. I thought there was an offensive goaltend there. Isaac gets a little closer. What is good, YouTube? This is your boy RJ back with another video for you guys. And I know that you guys that came to the stream was telling me about doing certain player videos for you guys. And you guys specifically mentioned about Diamond Jonathan Isaac. Now, I am on my account itself. I did pull Jonathan Isaac, um, his reward card that he is in the token market as a Diamond player. He is actually one of the top of the top of the line right now cards to get out of the token rewards if you guys are interested in this card you can't pass up a 6'10 player when it comes to my team he's a 6'10 small forward slash power forward that that's just something you can't pass up and he starts up as a power forward but you know you can put him at the small forward position preferably for me i like him at the power forward um due to the fact of just stretching the floor um, him being 6'10 with his wingspan, it makes it, it makes it the best of abilities, especially for the 3-2 zone or the 2-3 zone as well that I do run. Um, and, and he's just a goal on defense. If you, even if you go man, he can, he can play against your Greek, he can play against your Ben Simmons, he can play against your Magic Johnson. He can play defense, period. You know, he's always been a, I want to say a, I ain't going to say a glitch card, but more so of a, a dominant card as a budget player. Um, he's, like I said, listed as 6'10". You know, 99 defense, of course, 88 all offense overall. His three balls at an 88. You can more than likely get that up to a 90, let's see, what, a 92, 95, 96, around that range. Um, oh, def oh, three balls at an 87. So, yeah, same way, same thing. Also, as well as in looking at his defense. Perimeter defense at a 95, interiors at a 92. His steals is at a 94, goaded. Speed with the ball at an 82, speed is at an 87. What I like to look at in players is the speed, the perimeter, interior defense, can you shoot, and can you dunk. That's pretty much my, my main focus. Lateral quickness is a 97, which is beautiful. Um, shot IQ 60, uh, you know, see, like, that type of stuff is, like, shot IQ and stuff like that, I don't really find more so beneficial within the game because it's more so of a mental thing. Um, so I don't really look at that too much. Tendencies, I really don't look at either because I make things happen uh, on my own. Um... Let's see as well. Uh, badges, badges, badges. He has Hall of Fame catch and shoot corner specialist. Quick first step, pro touch. Trapper, pickpocket, rim protector, pick dodger, chase down artist. Clamps, defensive leader. Heart crusher, interceptor, intimidator, lightning reflexes, off ball pest, pogo stick, tireless school, tireless defender. And pretty much the rest of the badges is, you know, green machine, quick draw hot zone hunter stuff like that so this is a dominant defensive card out of jonathan isaac he can still get you that offense we're going to take him into a triple threat i'm going to show you guys what he can do now let me know in the comment section below do you guys like seeing triple threat gameplay or would you guys like seeing unlimited gameplay on um, that one because it's different triple threat gameplay is you know sometimes can be a hit or miss when it comes to using cards but you know mainly i preferably like to say that you know, if you want to use a certain card itself, I prefer to use Jonathan Isaac and I'll go crazy in anywhere I can do from limited to um, triple threat itself. Now, I know I mentioned that I will tell you guys the do's and the don'ts. And that's what I'm pretty much going to try to show you guys is what I like to do with Jonathan Isaac and what I don't like to do with Jonathan Isaac. So pretty much out of a standpoint, like I said before, Jonathan Isaac can stick this uh, Ben Simmons, but he's not. He's going to be sticking Shaq in this situation. Um, but the best thing about it, I, I just love him on defense, man. You know, he's able to contain everything itself. He's going to try to help set on that. You know, that's, that's going to be good itself. So my thing is to find out what Jonathan Isaac can do for you guys and what he can't do. Now, a lot of people say, oh, he doesn't have rain extender. That's fine, right? You know, he may not have rain extender, but he can definitely shoot that thing. Green bean, llama bean, machine. As long as you catch it, shoot it quick, he can shoot that thing. Let it ride with Jonathan Isaac, man. You know, be confident with Jonathan I Do not feel unconfident look at the defense look at the defense in jonathan isaac right there give him the ball go crazy okay uh-huh dishing it kick it back to jonathan isaac yep he about to chase him that's shack guard him straight to the rack same easy like i said before jonathan isaac can stretch out the floor and get to the bucket easily especially when it comes to that's why i like my power forward position because what happens is he can go up against people that like to run super bigs and jonathan isaac with him being lanky and can stretch the floor he's able to contain and move around the court faster so he can get past Shaq easily he's helping out on that good help defense right here the foul right here on the play 
Now he may get posted up in the paint, but he has Hall of Fame clamps. Don't let that fool you. You know, I want him to give, I want him to give the ball to Shaq. I want him to give the ball to Shaq. That's what I really want him to give the ball to. That's a good pass. That's a great pass. That's a great pass right there. But let me let me know what you guys think about Jonathan Isaac in the comment section below. Like I said, I like him. You guys sometimes don't know that Jonathan Isaac can also hit this pull-up jumper. That's got to be a good shot. Okay, you got to knock those down. Just know once you get the time and down pack with Jonathan Isaac, he can't hit those pulleys. Don't, don't get it twisted. Don't get it twisted. Look at the contest defense by Jonathan Isaac. That's with that pogo stick. Step back. Okay. Uh-huh. Hesitation. Let it ride, Jonathan. Okay. Shot it early. Time it, time it. You got to hold the shot with Jonathan Isaac just a little bit longer. Throw that pass. Okay. Get over that. Good defense. I like to see it. Good defense. Kick it back. Look at the defense by Jonathan Isaac on that Shaq. Okay. Oh, boy. Uh-huh. That's a steal. Good D, Tony Parker. Good defense. Now, I want to show you guys some pulleys with Jonathan Isaac. I know you guys are like, yo, can he hit those pulleys? Of course he can. We're not green them. Of course he can hit the pulleys when I green them. See, Jonathan Isaac's shot is different. Like I said, not say it's different, but it's easily timeable, but it's not at the same time. But it takes time to get a shot down pat. Once you get a shot down pat, you know, you have no problems there. Ah, uh, shouldn't have been no foul. I'm, I'm calling that rough. Um, but depth still. Oh, my Jesus. No love. Good dunk. Good dunk. I definitely want to start trying to, like, go to the rim and... My goal is to try to get this pull-up jump with Jonathan Ivy for you guys. Yes, he's stepping up on that. We're going to get that to fall, though. Just take him. And this is what I tell you guys. Take the shots, man. Feel confident with Jay Isaac, bro. Don't, don't, do not just not shoot the ball. I said do not, just not. But don't just not shoot the ball because you don't feel comfortable with him. Take those shots. Good pass. Good pass in the paint. Okay, this is a video for you guys to check out Jonathan Isaac. Let me see what his handle's looking like. Okay. All right. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Set him up for greatness. Cash. He got a little bit of handles. He, he got a little bit of Greek handles in his, in his system, I can tell. Um, Still. Okay, we take those. Imagine not getting that. Good defense. Good bucket. Of course, they get that to him. Good bucket. Time to hit this clutch move right here, man. Give me a clutch one, Jonathan. He's stepping back. Green Bean, Llama Bean. He can hit those pulleys, baby. Just take the shot, get his shot down, pack, and you go go crazy. Cut that off, cut that off, cut that off, cut that off. Okay, we here. That's a good foul. That's a good foul. I like to see that. I like to see that. We want to score the whole 21 off. Of, well, we're not going to score the whole 21, but damn near the whole 21. Get over there. You got to miss those. Oh, yeah. Oh, ain't that some shit. You ain't hitting that. You're not hitting that, Brody. You're not hitting that. Good defense. Beautiful defense. You gotta hit those. Beautiful defense. Beautiful defense right there. You see, he couldn't go up on Jonathan Isaac because he has that defensive leader. Also, as well as in, he has that Hall of Fame clamps, bro. You're gonna have a hard time. Let's go. Okay. Uh huh. Sizzle. Oh, you just off balling. Okay, makes sense. Oh, you got the little rappy rappies. Uh huh. Well, that's a good block. That's good defense. You know, AI almost damn near had the best defense with this side. Look at the defense, Jonathan Isaac. Oh boy, Intimidator, he's nervous. Low pass, Shaq, please. Low pass, Shaq, please. He's nervous right there. Hold on, let me, let me, get, a, let me get a pick and roll. Pick and roll real quick for the one time. Okay, kick it to Kobe. Uh-huh, kick it back to him, yup. Hesitation. That's a, that's good defense. You know, AI is gonna have to great defense, bro. It's gonna be hard to get around AI's, especially with his, his crossovers. His chips. Oh boy. Another. Oh, look at Jonathan Isaac with the defense again on Shaq. I'm going all the way this one. All the way. Foul. Okay. No foul call. Understandable. Still. Good dunk. That's cool. It's cool, bro. It's cool. It's cool. You just want to off ball to the full. This man is full fucking off ball. You know what? You know what? That's a white. Jesus. That's where he's getting his jump shot down pack. That's what it really is. 
That's all it takes. You gotta shoot those, cuz Chips. Thank you. Dunk him. Hey! We like to see it. We like to see it. Cut that off again. Chips. Oh my god. Can't get through that. Look at look at Jonathan Isaac with the steal. We dunking that. Lays. Hey! Bro, Jonathan Isaac has phenomenal defense in that paint, bro. Stop dribbling around Jonathan Isaac. Steal. Oh my goodness. Hey, Jonathan Isaac, go crazy, baby. Show me some. Like I said before, Jonathan Isaac is phenomenal on defense. 99. 99 defensive overall. Like I said before, man, if you play with Jonathan Isaac, I'll definitely recommend him being a pickup. The do's and don'ts. The do's is definitely with Jonathan Isaac is not to try to force a lot in the paint against bigs, but the don'ts is, um, oh, okay, wait, hold on, hold on. Let me try again. Oh, 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 oh. I'm gonna sauce them up a little bit. Oh, yeah. Game time. Jonathan Isaac, baby. Yo, show me some. As Jonathan Isaac can go crazy for you, this is what I definitely recommend with the dudes. The dudes with Jonathan Isaac is to keep Jonathan Isaac cutting. He's a great cut. He, he can cut to the basket. You know, take your open jumpers. Um, set uh, set pick and pops with Jonathan Isaac a lot. Set pick and rolls with him because he's very active. He's very active on offense. He's very active on defense. There's not really much to do on defense besides saying, you know, just use him. Uh, when you do on-ball on defense, use him a lot on on-ball defense. Trap with him on on-ball defense. And also go for the steals when they pass the ball on defense because he has that Hall of Fame interceptor badge. The don'ts. Do not force the ball with Jonathan Isaac. Don't try to go up on a big man because, it, it, you know, it's nine times out of ten, especially somebody like a pink diamond shot. Actually, that was an empty, so it's a hit or miss with that. But don't try to force it with Jonathan Isaac. Take your open jumpers, that's for sure. Um, don't cross over too much with him because he doesn't have a lot of the Greek anim animations, but he does have a crossover like Greek. So just don't do too much because he doesn't have that handle stability on him. Um, but I appreciate you guys tuning into this video. This is RJ Watts signing out. Hit the thumbs up button if you join the Laser Crew. Also, as well as and subscribe, you know the vibes. And also, don't forget to follow the Twitch. That's when we get lit on the live stream. You did.